Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Happy Valentine's Day. Today's video is going to be slightly different, but still in the style of Erica. I wanted to hop on and give a video for my girls like me who need ideas for Valentine's Day all by yourself because, sis, you're that bitch all by yourself. <laughs> so. This video is just me giving out ideas and my vibes about the holiday and everything itself. I don't really know how I want this video to go, so I feel like I'm just going to be talking. Um, yeah. <laughs> so, let's just start off by saying I am not a fan of Valentine's Day at all. Like, I've never liked it, even when I was, like, a younger kid, like, in, like, third grade. That's when I realized I hated the holiday and I hate the idea of, like, just forced love upon us all um <laughs> i just feel like you don't need that one set day to just be like i love you i feel like we should do this more often not just as like a valentine's day type of vibe where it's like you have to do something for your significant other um i'm saying um a lot <laughs> well you have to do but anyway yeah i don't feel like this is like the only time of the year where you have to do something for your significant other. And of course, you know, you have like birthdays and just random acts of kindness. But I don't know. I just feel like this is just so forced. And the fact that Americans spent $6 billion this year on Valentine's Day is beyond me. Like, it's freaking ridiculous. Um, Not to mention I hate flowers. Like, you know, they look cute just like in the room. I have like one of the Fleur du Perry rose boxes. Smells really good, but you know, just like liking flowers and just like always having fresh flowers or getting like a bouquet of flowers, it's just not me. Um, kind of like a tomboy, I guess, at heart. I'm a tomboy with like a ton of makeup, but I don't know. I'm just not that girly where I just like went, you know, the, val the Valentine's Day works. So, I'm going to be telling you how I am planning on making the best out of my Valentine's Day. Um, and hopefully it helps you make the best out of your Valentine's Day. Single or in something. <laughs> so, for me, my Valentine's Day is still going to be about love and it's self-love for myself. I'm going to be getting my life together. As you noticed, um, I'm dropping more videos, more content, really trying to get out there and just get everything out as much as possible. Um, my biggest support, well, support following per se is from Snap. So I really want to try to branch out my Snapchat followers to like my other platforms where I really want to grow at. So, yeah. I've spent a lot of time this morning writing down like a list of videos that I'll be dropping soon, like next week and the next week after that and so forth on. Um, also, I created my vision board um, today. I, I, so, I was so indecisive because I was supposed to drop um, a vision board party for myself, a video on that on the top of the year, but I didn't. I was just so, I really wanted to be focused on me. And I was so scared of, like, putting out, like, my plans and my visions for 2020 and, like, my future and everything like that. So, that is the only reason why I didn't drop that video. Um, just because I kind of, like, wanted to keep it personal, something really intimate. That way I could really just express who I am, what I want to do, what I'm going to do. So, in addition to jotting down everything that I wanted to do, I also took the time to just, like, work on myself um just stuff that makes you feel good for you for me what makes me feel good is like scrubs like i love scrubs from the head to the toe like so i took time i did a detox i've done my hair just stuff that makes me feel good this might not be what makes you feel good um but you know whatever makes you feel good you can go get a massage you can you know there's just like a lot of stuff that you know maybe makes you feel good isn't it and it doesn't even have to be you know like something like i did like personal like body wise you know it can be a walk in the park if you're a nature person or you can take a trip to the library and get some new books if you like to read or books a million or wherever people go to read books you can read at your house if you're in the books um you know if you're into TV like me, then you know you're catching up on Hulu for all of the new Simpsons and <laughs> Family Guy that's coming out this Sunday. That way, you know, you're fresh at it for Sunday when the new episodes drop. So, 
you know, just stuff like that. I also stocked up on all of my favorite ice cream, not to seem like, you know, a crybaby sex in the city type of girl, but you know, sometimes you need some bluebell cookies and cream in your life just to make everything feel better. But the main thing I wanted to say in this video is that even if you are single, that doesn't mean that you are not worthy of love just because you haven't found the right one um i know that valentine's day is like a really hard day for some people just because we're so grown to be booed up for valentine's day um i can't say that i have um well of course everyone's grown a little bit to just like associate valentine's day which like you're boo you're doing this you're doing that whatever but for me I just, I was never liked it. So, I know that for some people, it's kind of hard to, like, face that day alone. But, you know, it's okay, sis. That's what this video is for. Just to let you know that I got you regardless. You know, you're not single because you're not worthy or you haven't found the right one. It's because, you know, dick comes down a dozen. And it's easy to find some. It's just finding some that's made for you. <laughs> So anyway, like I was saying, I just wanted to remind you guys just to take time for yourself today. Just to remind yourself of all the great things about you. Because I feel like sometimes we need to hear it. And you don't always get to hear it when you need it. So, you know, with that all being said, like I said, this video is going to be fairly short and simple. Just giving you some Valentine's Day ideas, how to make the best of... I'm not going to call it a bad situation because sometimes you need to be single and to yourself just so that you can find the best version of you. Anyway, guys, just, you know, a little short video just basically to say I love you and thank you guys for all of the continuous support and love and good energy. But anyway... Thank you guys for tuning in to this little snippet video of me just rambling on about Valentine's Day and how I don't like the holiday, but I'm forced to be But anyway, thank you for watching this video just rambling on on and on because I wanted to get on and film something as like a an ending to this Valentine's Day segment. Um I want it just to have a little something something out for Valentine's Day for everybody, whether you're like a total glam. Whether you're like a total glam or a bedroom vixen. Or if you know you just wanted to talk and then I have something for everybody just because that's kind of like what I needed to zen myself out. You know, life gets hard. Um, and it's hard on all of us, so mm, you can just use this day not as to beat yourself up because you're single, but as a day where you can spread love to strangers, you know, or old people, or, you know, just something that you usually wouldn't do that's just like a nice act of kindness. You know, I feel like that would be a better turn on Valentine's Day for everyone. Um, and I don't ever, not ever, I don't want this video to be coming out like as, like I'm sad or anything. Because I'm not sad, I'm just venting on about life and Valentine's Day in general and just my perception of it. Um, and like I said, just like me making the best of a day that I really don't like. Um, <laughs> and I'm sure it's like a lot of people that feel the same way. It's just me rambling on about a day that I genuinely don't like. So, <laughs> that's pretty much it for this video. Um, like I said, it was just something different just because I wanted to come on and run my mouth a little bit. Thank you for letting me rant and vent. And if you haven't, check out my past two videos on Valentine's Day. I thought it was really cute or whatever. But yeah, please be sure to let me know your thoughts about the holiday, what you're going to be doing today. I'd love to interact with you. A lot of y'all have told me stuff on Snap already. So I cannot wait to see what the rest of you have planned for today. Um, and I'll see y'all in my next video. No. <laughs>